What is going on, my Gala gang? We had a tumultuous week. Uh, some bad news and some good news. Uh, so let's just jump right into the week's update. So good news is Gala Film, they dropped Razor. Uh, dropped yesterday. You can watch episodes one and two for free. Uh, coming along with that is going to be enabled earnings for uh, the moments and the scenes. So I'll explain a little bit about that real quick. So essentially, you can either buy a Razor Premiere Mystery Box. These are four bucks. And actually, you'll get, you'll get one of these for free every episode you watch, which is pretty cool. Uh, they have director cuts, so you can kind of like follow like a different aspect of the uh, show, um, like a clip or a scene, which is really, really cool. And then they have the Razor Moment Backs, which are 80 bucks a piece. They come with one moment. Essentially, you got a 10% chance for gold, 30% chance for silver, and a 50% chance for bronze. There's 36 of these moments. And essentially, if you can collect all of them, you'll get different kind of boostings uh, to the rewards you'll already get for having a moment when people watch Razor. So if you go to your collection, you can see your director's cuts over here, which is from those premium mystery boxes, which don't actually have earning attached to them. And then the moments and the scenes that make up those moment packs. So you can see your collectibles or you could go to rewards as well. If you're trying to find the scenes and how many you have of each scene to collect them. If you go to moments here or click into the scene, you can see the whole long list of all the different moments, how many golds there are. And when you complete every single one, you get a 50% boost uh, to the earnings. And I believe if you complete like a silver scene, you get a 30% boost and then like a bronze seed, a 10% boost, something like that. I don't know the exact heck breakdown, but I do know the completion for the 50% boost. And so after, you know, Razor gets going here, I'm assuming uh, Ghost of Ruin is probably going to be the next thing. And that's the, the first four episodes of that season 1A, which I'm really looking forward to as well. One aspect to think about as well is for Razor, there are two tracks, uh, one in episode four and one in episode nine, eight. I forget how, which ones. And anytime the episode is watched, that track would be played, right? And so it will actually count as listens on the Gala Music platform, which is crazy to think about because obviously if Gala Film blows up or Razor even blows up, the total listens to these tracks can really get uh, pretty crazy. And of course the earnings for them would be just massive, right? I did try to grab a couple of these, but uh, I was incapable of doing so because as always I'm at work and I uh, wasn't able to be here to click, click, click on my faster computer. So the sad news from an unofficial uh, source Michael McCarthy has a uh, quick gala uh, yesterday, uh, two days ago. What day are we on? And um, yeah, obviously I'm sure he is, uh, you know, kind of sad. This was his baby. Um, I would say that, uh, you know, he obviously is going to need some time. Um, I believe I also heard that he deleted his Discord and his Slack. So, um, you know, if you know any other way to get a hold of him, you know, please just give him some privacy. Uh, let him kind of you know, uh, think about this and obviously, uh, take a, a long walk in the woods. Um, along with that, uh, the Miranda's team, you know, being axed. And when I say axed, I want to be clear that the team is now, uh, the Chilean team, the Gala games development team in Chile, um, is going to be taking over Miranda's as well as they're taking over the walking dead empires, uh, down there as well. So, uh, the Chilean team, they have a lot on their plate, uh, to really, uh, man, really try to run with this. Um, they have some big shoes to fill, so we will see how that goes. A couple of other Gala Games specific things that I wanted to mention. One is, once again, if you are looking at actually trying to earn some Gala, I still think Poker Go Play is the best way to, to play and earn um, with the raffling. And of course, this is going to be changing a little bit going over to Gala Chip soon, as well as some other information that is coming out a little bit later this month. Um, that some of you will probably be quite interested in. Common Ground World, uh, you can tell that uh, I've read the recent announcements. I don't have to scroll, of course. Uh, I don't know where they're at with this right now. They got some cool stuff. As always, follow Dubstep Rod with the cool announcements on that. Mirandas. So today, uh, Bitbender did drop, or yesterday, last night, Bitbender did drop a post here basically saying, hey, uh, we want to make sure 100% that we're going to fulfill those promises. So here's a Google document to, for you guys to list out all the promises that you believe or perceive were made um, and put them all in there so that you're, you know, they're able to have a whole list of there. 
And of course, a lot of folks will say, well, it'd be nice if there was already some promises listed. So then we can know which ones are you know missing. But I know some folks are going through the old medium articles, old interviews, all that fun stuff. So that's going to be a lot of work for uh cool and everybody else who's uh, following that along the walking dead empires. Uh, I don't have any specific new news. I don't know why I clicked on that. I'll be honest. Eternal paradox. Uh, I know they are in the heat of season three. If you look, uh, I know dubstep rod, uh, the De- deadly guild, as well as the Ron, the Burgundy Guild, right? I forget I forget the name now. Uh, Square 13, I believe. Square 12. Square 12, I believe those two are the ones that are in the hot thick of it. Champions Arena, wanted to mention, because you can actually play, and I believe they're doing some free, some celebration champion giveaways here. So if you're playing between April 12th in April 26th, 13 days, they're doing some great prizes in here, really boosting your chances, uh, you know, by earning the entry points here. So definitely jump in, take a peek at that. Here's all the entry details, participation steps, how to get, you know, entry points for these. And then of course the top score winners, we're going to get a random legendary NFT champion, the top three. The next six are going to get a random epic. The next 20 are going to get a random rare. And then the next 20 are going to get 10,000 paid gems uh, to be able to use, which is really, really cool. Um, So definitely this is a time if you uh, haven't been in Champions Arena lately, maybe jump in, uh, check out this uh, cool celebration uh, they're they're doing. And I will say that the team um, or the the new kind of folks they switched out with in Champions Arena have definitely been leading this uh, a very positive direction, in my opinion, with the changes that they continue to kind of make to the game and update to the game, really kind of bring it in, to, in line to at least what I think uh, is is the best and, and the coolest. So, and if you didn't notice in your founders, you know, founders node or in your inventory, Legends Reborn, uh, Tolk is live and that's the, uh, the specific token to last uh, uh, Legends Reborn. So that's really, really cool. And I don't have any specific things for Last Expedition yet. Just waiting on uh, basically the, the new play test to come out. Or not the pl- new play test, the new build. Um, but I will say that every Friday, if you want to jump in, 3 o'clock, uh, we definitely have full lobbies, play against the devs, with the devs. Really fun. You get to hear a lot of alpha from them. So if you're interested, definitely take a peek in there. And we did see when I was looking at all the Gala Chain uh, explorers that I did a live uh, viewing on so that you can vote on it. So if you haven't voted yet, you should definitely check them out. There's four. They're really cool. Um, we saw that there are some items that we'll see coming soon for Le- last expedition. And uh, yeah, it's amazing how if you stare at that gala chain, you can really see some uh, some sneaky things in there if you, if you know where to look. Uh, that's pretty much the week uh, that we got. Let me know what you think down below. I'm not wearing a razor hat because I don't have one. So Ghost Rune is what I have. As always, stay warm, Wookiees. Ooh, doo, 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 doo.